Welcome back everyone, my name is Brian. And I'm Jen. And today we got some Roblox Series 7 to open up. Uh, we have never opened these before, but I thought they looked pretty cool. So we have 10 total to open. Uh, each one has a figure in it and possible accessories goes with it. And let's see, yep, you get a bonus success. May include bonus accessories, so it's not guaranteed. But we'll get a checklist somewhere in here so we can see hopefully all the figures we can get because we don't know how many total there are. Yeah, and it looks like there's a virtual item code also. So we'll hold it up because we don't play this, but yeah. if anybody, I mean, I don't, I'm assuming it's only one per, per thing, but. Let's, uh, let's throw it up there. We have some tight plastic on these. Um, let's pause it. We'll open these up. I'll we'll peel the plastic off of them and then we'll start opening. Sounds good. All right, we got them all unwrapped. You can see these actually have letters on them. So we roll the spell blocks and then blob. There's not our X in here and then hello. So <laughs> why don't you go ahead and get started? All right. So let me just pop open. All right, so it looks like it's a character to build. Oops, I ripped my checklist. So looking at this, oh, I believe I have Tower Defense Simulator Cyber Medic. Mm -hmm. This one right here. Yep. So and you can see there's quite a few that you can get. So there's like core packs, game packs, Adopt Me Backyard. Tons of them, yeah. uh, mystery boxes. So yeah. there's all kinds of. They're really sorry. easy to build. It's like a few parts. So yeah. So we'll um, we'll build them all at the very end. Cool. Mmm. Whoa. Cool. Look at this guy. Ooh, I like him. Yeah. Little monster. He's a. Uh... He just has like two parts. He just goes right in like this and has a gun. Well, that's easy. <laughs> yeah. That is Thrill Island Chomper. Look at him. Pretty cool. That is. Gun there. And yeah, there's another checklist, an exclusive virtual item, the metal chomper. Scratch, you're not sure if we're doing that, so. Um, there we go. It's all right, cool. They stand pretty good, too. All right. So it looks like the exclusive code you have to scratch off. So we'll do that at the very end. All right, so this one looks like, oh, I think it's a ballerina. Oh, cool. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, Very blocky one. Oh, I guess I should have put on the skirt first. But, so I'll do it here in just a second, but you can see they're pretty easy to build. I just need my, my arms closer to myself. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. It's hard to see where the top is on some of these. Oh, there it is. Ooh, what did I get? Oh, wow. So we got this character here, it's like a mummy. And it comes with this little piece here, a little accessory. I'm not sure where that goes, but this head would just go like on like this. And, oh, must be like a weapon of some mm. sort. That looks like uh, Shark Bite Studios Mummy Minion. Huh. Well, I'm not sure what that little cat is, but he does not attach to him. But pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm getting easier ones to build. You're getting the ones with <laughs> all the little parts on them. Yeah, that's not uh, fair. <laughs> at the end, what we'll do is we'll just we'll scratch these and then just reveal them in the camera. And if anyone plays this, they can just take the code here. All right, and the the ballerina that I opened, her name was Aurora. All right. Ooh, hair flying. All right, so this one looks like maybe it's a character wearing a tux. Yep, this is Royal High Server Zed. You can see there is his face. And then he has a tray that he can carry. And this one's super easy. I finally got an easy one. Mm-hmm. Do we have hair? Yep, there is hair too. So he has this tray. Oh yeah. 
Server. And then his. <laughs> That's yeah. funny. Cool. <laughs> so. All right. No duplicates, which is nice so far. So that's good. So I can see where they said some have accessories and some don't. Yeah. Ooh, I think I got a double ballerina. Let's see. This the one? Yep, yep, that's the ballerina. This is a duplicate. So we will keep that one wrapped up. I just jinxed this hardcore because I said no duplicates and then I got one. Of course. <laughs> that's what you always do. Put that one back. <laughs> Sorry guys. All right, so there we go. Oh, it looks like I might have another, or no, this isn't a ballerina. You sure? No, uh, well, it might be a ballerina, but it's not the one that I opened. This is, I think this is Royal Ballet Academy of Roblox. Um, Let's see. So oh, yeah, um, this one has red hair with some flowers or leaves. And then she has a white outfit, a uh, white tutu, and then um, a branch accessory. So we'll get cool. her set up here in just a moment. Oh, this is a new mm -hmm. one. Flew everywhere, but let's see what we got. So we got, whoa, it's got a hood. It looks like an Eskimo hood of some sort. Oh, that's cool. And then this would just go right in there like this. Legs there. Another easy one. And then, yeah, this one's pretty cool. And then it's got a little, um, it looks like a snow dog or something of some sort, or a fox, or snow fox or something. Very cute. Oh, I like that one a lot. That one is Star Sorority Winter Tracker. I like that one a lot. Mm-hmm. That one's cool. All right. Another new one. All right, so this one has um, maybe a, like a jacket over like a blouse or something. Looks like there's a little bunny. Mm-hmm and um, a headpiece. Oh, that's cool again. And pants. One looks good, it's really cool. Yeah. Um, this one is Pet Ranch Simulator. Interesting name. Oh no, duplicate again. Oh no. Eskimo, shoot. We got two duplicates, it doesn't bad at all the ones we open, right? That's not. Um, but let's go ahead and get them all put together and set up and we'll pick our favorite and then we'll reveal the scratch. Okay, we've got these all set up. Um, we got eight total, which is pretty good. Mm -hmm. 10, only two duplicates. Uh, which one's your favorite? Um, I, oh gosh, this is gonna be hard. Um, so I'm gonna go with the winter tracker because I like the little fox and the outfit, the cape and everything that comes with it. Mm -hmm. But I also really like the mummy. Um, yep. The Minion Mummy. I will say, just for the ballerinas, those skirts were really hard to um, put on because the, you have to line them up perfectly. And every time I'd put them down, then the legs would move, and so then they would jump all over. But wow, I got yeah, them were. together. So. <laughs> yep. So uh, yeah, I like the this one as well. I like this one a lot too because it reminds mm -hmm. me of like, an old sci-fi movie. Oh there, yeah, so. I can see that. Mm -hmm. Really cool. So. Yeah, so these are pretty cool. Uh, we got these codes now. We'll just, I don't know if anyone plays this, but we'll show them to the camera. If you guys do, you can use these. Now we, we have, obviously, eight total, so let's just go one by one here. Let's see what we have. So let's focus in. And I don't know how many will be able to actually use it. It's There's probably like first. a one, one and done, but. Cool. Second one. You'll probably want to pause when we do this. Third, that's a eight there. Fourth, it's five at the end. Nine five. Yep. Five. Six. Six. 
seven. And the last one, number eight. And there we go. All right, well you guys, thanks for watching as always. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye everyone, see you tomorrow.